Hello guys, welcome back to the news. This is Bliss Channel. If you are just joining us, please kindly subscribe to this channel. And do not forget to give us a thumbs up. Reasons why Abuja suspected kidnapper mentioned Bola Tinibu while being interrogated by police. My people, my people, this is shocking and surprising. How can a president of a country be mentioned in an issue of criminality and kidnapping? Anyway, let's see what the suspected kidnapper said about President Bola Tinibu. So guys, let's hear the content and details of the news. In a surprising turn of events, a suspected notorious Abuja criminal, Shinaza Philip Okoye, made an unexpected greetings to President Bola Ahmed Tinubu during his interrogation by the police. Disputing the allegations leveled against him, Philip Okoye vehemently denied being a kidnapper, asserting that he was solely involved in harmed robbery activities. During his interrogation at the FCT Police Command, Philip Okoye revealed that his criminal endeavors primarily revolved around car snatching and car theft with the Federal Capital Territory, operating alongside his gang members. This disclosure shed new light on the nature of his criminal activities and alleged and challenged the initial characterization of him as a kidnapper by law enforcement authorities. However, the unexpected greeting to President Tinibu and the subsequent denial of involvement in kidnapping underscore the complexities surrounding criminal investigation and the varying narratives presented by suspects and law enforcement agencies. As the case unfolds, further scrutiny and investigation will be necessary to ascertain the full extent of Philip Okoye's criminal activities and the implications for law enforcement efforts in Abuja and beyond. However, in a now trading video shared by S user, Philip Okoye began his confession by congratulating President Bola Hamed Tinibu and Hamed Issa, the ordinary president and host of the Brekete family show in the FCT. Abuja, the suspected kidnapper Philip Okoye stated that it was his first time joining the robbery gang to steal cars in Abuja's Gaki neighborhood. He claimed that the gang leader instructed the victim to sit in the back seat of the automobile because it was not in their plans. According to him, Yellow the gang leader planned to withdraw money 
from the victim's account before being detained by the police. Earlier, it was alleged that Philip Okoye claimed to be an harm robber rather than a kidnapper, as reported by the police. He said this when explaining how he was arrested by the police. Philip Okoye said he want to categorically state that he is not and never a kidnapper. He said they only patrol at night and collect cars from their victims and thereafter take these cars to Kanu to sell them. Recall in an earlier post, the Federal Capital Territory FCT Police Command announced the arrest of Philip Okoye, a known Abuja kidnapper. Shinaza was arrested by Kaduna State Police on Thursday, January 18, 2024. SP Josephine Ade, the Federal Capital Territory Police Public Relations Officer, reports that the suspect is currently in police custody. So guys, how do you see to this report? Please kindly feel free to share your comment on the comment section. And do not forget to like, share, and subscribe to this channel. Thank you.